Last was going to be Pierre Rutledge. Go over there. Jimenez, same thing to you. You can have a conversation with Pierre. Jimenez a little wavering. Rabina, okay. Pierre, how you doing? Uh, what's happening? Okay, this is the role you're going to play in my administration. And Luke, this is the role he'll be playing in my administration. He'll be he'll be a guy that's in there. And that'll make sure, you know, he's only going to answer to me. He ain't going to answer to nobody else. And he's going to be involved in, in urban development. He's going to be involved in the things that 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 you that so so that was my thing you know because I told them both look personally I feel like I'm the best guy at the job but at the end of the day it's not about me it's about the people it's about us getting something done you know and that's the only way I'm gonna feel good to stand on the podium and feel like I'm going we're, we're taking this you know uh, and getting something done and that was my whole thing to both of them one I felt he was a little hesitant the other one, hey, this is what he'll work at, this is what he'll do, this is what, you know. Again, I'm looking at, you know, both guys like, I don't know either one of y'all, but I can only call it how I see it. So I then did the research on each individual. When I look at Jimenez, you know, uh, when they made the statements about him, first thing uh, to me was, how, how are you in, how do the people feel in your district, number one, that you've served? You go in there and you talk to Ms. Gibson, you know, in the African American community in uh, in uh, in uh, Coconut Grove, and I go to the Goombe Festival, and with the Rose, has has uh, Carlos been out here? Carlos never been out here. Like we're buying a wine, uh, because he's this guy. He's never done anything for us. So if you're not loved by the people in your district, that's the problem. You know, that's a problem. Now, you telling me that, oh, you know, I'm going to be doing all these different things, and then you ride around the neighborhood in that district, and it's like, look like uh, uh, District 2. You know what I'm saying? Even you're in a, a very vibrant district with a lot of money in that district that you should be, your, your projects should look like condominiums. You, you see what I'm saying? And so, and they should be throwing out the red carpet for you. So that kind of concerned me already. You know, you, you hear things, but now let's deal with the actual facts of it all. You know, how do people in your district feel about you? The have feel good, great about you. The have not, does not. So and in the case of humans. In, in the case of humans. So then, you know, then I go, and, oh, let me see if I'm reminded. You know, um, Firefighters, no doubt about it, they they really if if he's a, if he in high live if he get an accident they might not show up. They hate him that bad. And in high live the firefighters, no question about it. They have their reason for hating him, but at the same time the police love him. You know he made hard decisions. And then at the same time when I look at him and I talk to uh, Pastor Rich over at Trinity uh, Church and he said uh, uh, Luther, you know, guy who supported me. You know, um, you know, I sent out an email three years ago about, you know, all to all the mayors, invite them to, you know, our church. And only one showed up three years ago, and that was Julio Rabina. And I hear another story, the guy in Sweetwater. So you got a lot of different stories about this guy. You know, you know, you got good stories, and then you got the bad stories. So when I look at the two, you know, I'm, I'm like, I'm mad as hell that we didn't have enough time because I know I could have beat both of them. I'm like, and you know, put my ego to the side and put my personal feelings to the side because it's not about me, it's about the people. Can I get something done? And I say I feel more comfortable, you know, with with Julio, you know, assuming that he can get things done. The issues he know, I mean, the guy I'm going to the meeting with the guy, he tells me, Luke, we, we got to do something about this Memorial Day weekend. We can't have that black eye. And I didn't even come there to talk to him about it. Yet. That tells me you're on the ground floor of things. You know, you understand, yeah, okay, you're right, Mary, because at the end of the day, if if it go down the way the people on Miami Beach wanted to go down, Miami, it ain't going to be just South Beach. It ain't going to say South Beach. They're going to say Miami is a racist right. place yeah. and the black people are not wanted. That's how it's going to go across the viral web. And we're going to be in deep shit. So for you to say that to me, and understand that means now you know that I know the issues. 
So that is one guy, you know, that may be, you know, one. So it became one guy is like this, and then one guy kind of got his hand on the pulse of a lot of things. So two of the